It's true. Stacy only pretended to be a match for Shane. How? People are either a match or they're not. You can't fake out science. You can if you switch your stem cells for someone else's. What? Do you have proof? I'm working on it. See, there is hope for you and Rex. Yeah, and I can finally tell him that I didn't sleep with you. <laughs> I'll just wait to talk to my dad. Now, don't you think he'd want you to get this off your chest? You can tell your Aunt Stace anything. No, thanks. What, you don't trust me? It's not that. Well, good, because number one, you can totally trust me, and number two, I'm like your bud sister. I saved your life. The last thing I want to do is see you all bent out of shape about something. This is pretty huge. Hit me. It's about my mom. I heard her telling her friend that she really didn't cheat on my dad with Brody. Wait, so your mom's telling people she didn't cheat on your dad? Well, I only heard her tell one person. Who? Uh, this new guy she's been hanging around with. Uh, Skylar? I heard her say that she lied about <clears throat> being with Brody. Why would she do that? <laughs> That's a good question. Well, my dad should know. Maybe it would make him feel better, and maybe my mom could apologize and he'd forgive her. I mean, if no one cheated, my parents can get back Wait, together, right? Wait, Wait. Okay, listen to me. Your mom did cheat with Brody. I'm sorry. I know this is hard to hear, but... But she said that she... Yeah, I know. You're probably wondering why she told Skylar that she didn't cheat, but... Listen, I'm gonna give it to you straight, because I'm not gonna lie to you, okay? Your mom did what she did because she has a thing for Skylar. She doesn't want him to think she's a slut. Rex, how long have you been here? Long enough to see you groping your boyfriend, one of the many. Hey, that's not cool. I'm just calling it as I see it. I need to talk to Gigi. Can you go away now? So, last night you barged into my apartment with that psycho Skylar, and now you're back with this jackass. Rex, don't jump to conclusions. I got eyes, Gigi. I'm not jumping to anything. You are obviously a busy girl. Hey, none of my business, just so as long as it doesn't affect our son. I'm a good mother. You know that. Don't you ever say I'm not, even if you're just trying to make a point. Look, you're just not who I thought you were. You've been doing some really crazy things. You're right. I have been. And pretty soon, I'll explain all of that to you. And then some. What does that mean? 